And if you was the one, put your feelings aside, we can keep this low. Feeling your vibe on the regular. God sent me a sign from the stars above. Had to decide if you was the one, put your feelings aside, we can keep this low. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Sass, and I'm back with another one, Straight Facts. If you haven't already, make sure you drop those comments down below, subscribe to this channel. Make sure you hit the bell on the side to get notified when I post. And what's last but not least, make sure you like this video up. Like this one, this one, this one, the last one, last one, and the last one before that. Do it yourself for me and for the whole team. So, as you guys can tell by the title, you already know what the main question is. Am I doing vlogmas? Okay, last year I did vlogmas, and it was lit. I had fun doing vlogmas, but this year it's a little different. Um, it will be a little different. So I waited to the last minute. I waited to the last minute. I waited to the last minute to either think about doing vlogmas. I waited to like last week. Then I was like, okay, I'm gonna go run a Target and probably give me like a little cute little little Christmas onesie or whatever or a little christmas pajama thing and shoot my own because i got two cameras i got this one i told y'all this one is the one that um i got this camera and i got my camera in the back my actual camera this camera someone gave to me i gotta make sure i get this make sure i don't do nothing to this girl camera but yeah, this camera someone gave to me. Um, yeah, so I could, um, I yeah, I was gonna do that. Go run to Target, give me a cute little, um, a cute little like onesie or an outfit or something like Christmassy, and then shoot my own like intro or whatever. Put my own little song so I know how to, I know how to do all of those type of things. But then last week. It just got too busy. I've been working. Yeah, I've been working, trying to make extra money. And let's see, that's the thing about doing YouTube and working or doing YouTube and you're a full-time student. When you're a full-time student, it's a little different because you don't have to go to work all day. Like, I work from 8 to 4. And it was 9 to 5, or it was 8 to 5. But then, since they increased the, um, they... Put, they went back to the, their normal schedule way before COVID happened since last year. Um, it's two two um two shifts, so you either come from eight to four or nine to five, or you either come from eleven to seven. So I, that's been the three times or whatever, and I work from eight to four. So damn that my whole day gone. And after when I get off, I lately since the past like two or three weeks, I've been doing assignments left and right. Like I go home, tell y'all, I go to work eight to four go home i send a call maybe like 30 i always send a call as y'all see but i send a call for about 30 minutes i play a game or listen to music since it's been cold i've been trying to soak up the little heat or whatever because my house be so fucking cold but um after that i go inside charge my computer while i'm charging my computer um i start my assignments um usually um lastly if last the last two weeks it's been paper and powerpoint so trying to submit that in a timely fashion then take a shower i go um pack a couple of clothes or whatever and then go with my cousin where she stays down the street and do that and do catch up on like any kind of like youtube videos like anything that's trending and stuff like that so lately that's what i've been doing but i guess since i have free time um we i last i submitted my last project yesterday um yesterday it was due at eight o'clock but i had didn't i had been some i had been did it and turned it in but we had to turn it in on two sites we had to do it on the actual school website and we had to do it we had to submit it on the school other website um live text so i submitted that yesterday morning and now i'm just waiting for final grades to post but um last december like it was a little lit it was a different COVID didn't happen. We was able to travel outside of the, um, the state. So late, and then it didn't. It, I wasn't graduating, but now I'm graduating. So I've been trying to get things. I try to what um envelope, but I've been 
had to go get um dental dental papers um this morning make sure i got all my like um records i don't think i put it in here but last week and last week um when i was all i went to all the um i went to get a tb uh tb test for internship um in january and what else i did oh i went to my actual primary doctor and try to get a hold of my immunization records so last week that's what i did this week it was focusing on actually finding a uh, internship so i got this lady number right here i went there got her number can't really see it yeah you can see it now but i got her number and so that's what i've been doing so vlogmas will be a little hectic it will be a little different um i still will be giving y'all content but it just won't be every day it probably will be every other day but my life is so boring y'all it's so boring maybe yeah my life is so fucking boring maybe because yes i do have another channel um I do have another channel with um Tootie. Um I told y'all the thing that the thing that happened with Sass and Tootie TV. Um if y'all haven't already go watch that. But um it's about maybe a couple of couple of videos behind. But I'll insert the clip and y'all can what you call them? Go watch it. But um yeah, so um maybe Sunday, cause y'all I have a lot of friends and a, a lot of friends, but my friends stay all over. One just moved across the river um, in Harvey. The other one stay in Biloxi. The other one stay in the east and we all work. And it's so hard. And then the other one stay in Baton Rouge. So it's so hard like to actually like do videos with them and do like collabs with them and pranks with them or pranks on them or whatever. Because if y'all know me, I'm the prank queen but yeah it's so hard so maybe i think sunday we all are all me and two of my other friends we all all and we're supposed to be linking to going to my friend cousin graduation party sunday but probably before the graduation we probably can do this video i got a game in my trunk that i never did i was supposed to do with my little cousins maybe we could do this the speak out loud game maybe we could do that and i give y'all like a video on that but like i'm trying y'all so y'all just gotta bear with me and I was still uploading videos from my, my Atlanta trip, which y'all know in Atlanta. I went to Atlanta a whole month ago and still dropping videos. That tells you that my life is just so busy. But um, I'm going to do better. Um, and I know my grandma, my grandma's birthday is coming up in Franklinton. So I'll probably be back out there. I wanted to do the WAP, um, the WAP reaction, um, singing the WAP song um, around my daddy. Um, but I didn't get a chance to do it. It was so damn cold, y'all. But I didn't get ch get a chance to do it. But I will be doing next soon. So stay tuned for that. And stay tuned for a lot of little different things that I have planned for y'all. But um, as far as me doing vlogmas, um, yes, I will be participating in, in it. But it won't be your average vlogmas. Switch it up a little for y'all. But um, yeah, I just wanted to share that with y'all. So be on the lookout for that. And we're gonna look look out for every, uh, like other little videos and talks and story times and little you know, things like that that I have for y'all. And yeah, so um, just stay tuned, y'all. Stay tuned, stay tuned, and stay tuned. I love y'all and keep supporting. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to subscribe to Life of it and come join the plush gang, 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 gang. Say your mama, your daddy, tell, tell everybody. I'm telling y'all, tell everybody. And don't forget to keep supporting and support. You know, y'all need to. I put it on my Instagram, but y'all need to really start supporting black businesses. Like even if it's just someone local, like even if it's just like nails or hair or a clothing line or any any like. Cause I tried. Like I went to a couple of pop up shops, bought um bought some clothes, bought some like um pieces or whatever. Um, buy, I buy eyelashes, um, I buy hair, um, you know, different things like that. Even if it's just not even with my YouTube, because I know that like my numbers is going up and down, which is not about the numbers, but I just want y'all to keep supporting, keep supporting and keep supporting black businesses. 
um because that's what we need a lot of you know people in this now generation they lack it they lack it a lot but they yeah they lack it a lot of people in this generation they lack that a lot um they always want to compete with the next person or they don't want to you know give give credit what credit is due and i always do if 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 you about your business if you promoting your business if you like like i'm gonna show y'all it's been um a couple of people that i just personally dm uh people from out here um that i dm that i've seen like just come up they're younger than me but i've seen them like come up with so one of them rap and on the other one they both rap they both rap one is older than the other i think she like two years older i think one is 18 and one is 16 but i'm gonna put the dm right here and i just like i love giving credit what credit is due and i don't have an issue with it and if i see you grinding and doing your thing and posting and trying to interact with your um with your, your supporters your followers or whatever um i don't mind dm you i dm you real quick and you know be like you know i like what you i recently did that to my cousin i love y'all i'm gonna show y'all but make sure y'all stay tuned for everything that i have planned for y'all um that something that i re really that is something that i'm really passionate about and you don't see a lot of it in louisiana um new orleans Baton Rouge, franklinton slidell what like any local all of these like local areas mandeville um you don't see a lot of people supporting one another and that's what we need to improve especially in my city new orleans i love my city i love everything about it but that is something that we need to improve instead of trying to one-up somebody or trying to be better than the next person yeah it's okay to you know think of yourself as you know high tech and you know high quality and stuff like there's nothing wrong with it but don't belittle somebody don't look down on them support them support them even if it's just a small text because you never know where they might go but yeah i just wanted to share that with y'all i love y'all you gonna let me come through this bitch